Okay. After you've done that, you right. This is quite an um, important bit which you uh, have to concentrate on. You find a run. Uh, you can probably type it into search here or find it in your programs. I'm not sure where it is located, so um, I'll probably put it in the video description when I find out. Okay, just go run, and as I type uh, typed in here already, I'll go to ms config, which is spelled m s c o n f i g, ms config. Press OK, and up. Uh, page will come up that looks a tiny bit like task manager which you get from pressing control alt delete uh, it may look like task manager but it's a task manager for permanent use look through all these here and right for services to hide a tick hide all Microsoft services you do not want to stop any of them working because it may disrupt your computer so just tick hide all Microsoft services, quite important. And look through all these are all the programs that run as a service when you start up your computer. See, as you may see, I've unticked quite a few here. I do not need these. Uh I've I'm running Acer at the moment. Um Acer like uh gives you I've have an Acer computer at the moment, so I'm not running Acer. Uh, which an Acer gives you quite a lot of programs like E whatever empowering technology and I never ever used it so I just stopped it and it well sped up my startup really and well overall performance I just found it was quite good and even if you don't uh, run Acer you may find your computer just gives you uh, loads of services that you don't ever use and maybe other programs you have uh, downloaded uh, give you services that you don't ever use so just stop them running and you'll be uh, fine you will find that you it does speed up your PC quite a bit right um, then after you've uh, looked through all the services just uh, just uh, go to startup which is on the right of services and here you will find all the programs that start up when you boot up your computer you may see I have stopped quite a few programs from booting up, which slow down your PC. Uh, what's the fuck was that? Um, I've got malware removal box, so on. Uh, any DVD? I, d I don't even have any DVD. It, it just used to start up by itself. Just my computer just confused and just starts it up, and it's not there. It was just it is quite a nuisance, and it does slow your PC down. So look through all these. Um, just just stop any programs that you never use and uh, from starting up, and you will see that it just boots up a lot faster because it does not have to start up all these programs here. Okay, so after you've done that, you may have to restart your computer. Uh, so just do that. Restart your computer. Come back and do do this again. Uh, not do this. Uh, I just uh, well you see a screen like this and you may even see that it boots up faster after you restarted your computer right two more programs which you will need uh, AS logics and C, C cleaner these two programs are cleaning programs that's a this is a defrag program this is a sort of registry cleaning program I find these these very 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 good uh, for like speeding up your PC and so that it like um, cleans out all the programs that you can't get to yourself. So let's say uh, AS uh, Logics uh, disk uh, defrag here. I'll actually run it. You can just I can't actually run it because it does need like five gig or fifteen percent of the space available on your hard drive to work properly. But I can run it on my other drive, which has got a fifteen gig. You see, as it says, fifth. No, it does not have fifteen. Uh, not fifteen gig. Sorry, fifteen percent free space, as it says there. It does need fifteen percent free space to run properly. And uh, no, I don't know what to continue. Uh, 
so you do need to clean out quite a few programs maybe move them around a bit uh, put them on your external storage or put them into another drive on your computer like your D drive or something and then you uh, then you can run it so you will need to get rid of quite a few programs if you are the programs or files um, to free up so it's like 15 um, percent is like a usual it's quite a good amount of space on your hard drive to have for your computer just to function normally anyway so I have to actually myself clean out my PC uh, quite soon okay. and then after you've run actually before you run defrag I'm sorry I uh, run CC uh, C cleaner uh, I keep calling it CC cleaner I just maybe C just run cleaner uh, analyze it will analyze all your temporary Windows files, so on, so on, recent document files. That you, that it, it just stores up for memory on what you used. You probably never even used your recent memory files and temporary documents for the computer, which stores for other programs. So it'll just take a few minutes to analyze. Then you all you do is run cl uh, cleaner. Then you go to your red. Uh, sorry, uh, just let this finish. Bum, 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 bum. Also, it gives your information. As you see, I'm running quite a average computer at the top here. <laughs> okay, um, we're back. And uh, this is uh, what it looks like when you've uh, run your analyzation. Then all you do is click Run Cleaner. Okay. It may take a few seconds to clean it out. As as you see, it's running into an Explorer Cleaner. And then there we go. Um, I'm now apparently we've rem uh, removed just um, 864 MB from my computer which is quite a decent amount then you run registry cleaner which just cleans all your registry scan for issues and uh, it will find a bunch of stuff which you should clean out and okay I uh, just leave that to run uh, you get you get the point just run uh, run this program a few uh, once then run this program uh, AOS logics and it will defrag all your computer, uh, move all your folders aside, delete all the unwanted fol all the folders that you don't need, and it knows you don't need, like program folders, and it will just uh, speed up your PC, and it will show you a percentage of uh, how much uh, it speeds it up, like 14% uh, faster, your computer goes 7%, maybe even 20%, and it gives you a full report which is you are quite handy okay so this has been how to speed up your computer and thank you for watching if you like uh, this video or any of my other videos please do subscribe to my um, the channel and I shall have more videos like this coming um, if you have any uh, questions or anything please comment or message me I'll be uh, I'll answer your queries uh, the same day most of the time and thanks for watching everybody this is Big Mr. Shell how to speed up your computer bye everybody